In this video, I'm going to show you how you can update firmware of VIFO dash camera. So let's get started. First of all, plug in the SD card into the PC or laptop slot. So once it gets detected, you will need to format it. Right click on the SD card, select format. You will need to select X FAT format or else if you have FAT32, then you can even format it to FAT32. Click on start button, click on OK and this will complete the formatting click on ok and close this box now we'll need to download the firmware file required for the update open the web browser in google type vifo from the search result you'll need to click on the vifo.com which is the official website of vifo dash cameras so from the home page under support click on firmware and manual this will take you to the vifo support crawl down the page and over here all the dash cameras by vifo will be listed so select the dash camera which you have and this will take you to the specific dash camera page scroll down the page and top at the firmware section so these are the firmware files which we will need to download in order to update the firmware of the dash camera as this is a dual dash camera this is having two firmware files which needs to be downloaded so download both these files the file extension will be dot bin the version of the firmware will also be mentioned so it will be easy for you to decide whether your dash camera is having outdated firmware or not so if this version differs from your current dash camera version then you need to update it once you finish downloading just open the folder where you have downloaded this file copy both of these files and paste it into your SD card which you recently formatted so once you have copied these files just eject your SD card and let's move on to the updating process of the firmware on the dash camera so don't turn on your dash camera first insert the SD card into the dash camera SD card slot and then turn on the dash camera once the dash camera turns on the update process will begin so here you can see the updating firmware message is coming on the screen so this means the firmware files has been detected on this SD card and the update process of the firmware has been begun so this will take few seconds to complete the update process the status bar will also be displayed while the update make sure you don't turn off the dash camera or remove the key from the so the firmware has been successfully updated a message has been displayed over here so this will restart the dash camera and now it will ask us to select the language of the dash camera which you prefer select the language press on the ok button select the time zone select ok then you can select from speed units mph to kilometer per hour select any of it and it will ask us to format the micro sd card click on ok this will format the memory card so memory card has been formatted now the dash camera is ready to capture if you wish to cross check the version of the firmware which you just updated first of all turn on the wi-fi of your dash camera by keeping the wi-fi button pressed for a few seconds until you hear wi-fi turned on sound go to your mobile turn on the wi-fi and make sure you connect to the access point of the vifo if you wish to know how to set up the vifo app then i have made a dedicated video on it you can watch that video once you connect to the access point just press back open the vifo app tap on connect your camera button and this will open the live view of the dash camera so to check the version tap on the settings gear icon which is displayed at the bottom of the page scroll down the setting page and under other you will be able to see the firmware the firmware version will be mentioned over here so this is the version which we updated so this is how you can easily update your vifo dash camera through this method you can easily update any of the dash camera by the brand vifo if you have any problems while updating the dash camera you can comment down below on this video i will try to reply to all your comments.